students we have already discussed in the previous two videos about important characters and the plot development and in previous video we were discussing about the uh, ending scene and that is the ending scene about the uncle khusro and the farmer john byro that communication again little bit we will uh, uh, revise that on page number 6 pay no attention to it my uncle kusro road and sir what good is a sari without a horse for that question there is a reaction such type of replies uh, it is here given by the <coughs> uncle kusro pay no attention to it my uncle kusro road i walked ten miles to get here the john byro said you have legs my uncle kusro shouted means each and every reaction it is totally contrast different reaction we are observing my left leg pain pains me the farmer said pay no attention to it again same same uh, response here repetition of the same statement it is pay no attention to it and it is the comic aspect that we can observe means sometime uh, in different stories adventurous stories or some climax also different aspects of the stories we can observe here and now what will happen and suspense is also there right whether um, the boys will return that horse or not so all the things here uh, it is properly uh, maintained properly pictureized by the author and then my uncle kusro road uh, the horse cost me 60 dollars the farmer said spit again the response is spit on money the uncle kusro road we cannot imagine that this type of response someone would give you he would be angry suddenly but that farmer was very good person uh, he got up and you know, stopped out of the house slamming the screen door my mother explained he has a gentle heart so here mother is uh, talking about the uncle kushro that even though he was furious uh, then his uh, enormous personality but the thing it is about the experience about the same person hmm, it is different means we cannot analyze person only in one perspective here how we experience that person we may uh, create that generalization about that so here he has a gentle heart she said it is simple that he is homesick and such a large man so here we can observe we can observe about the uncle kusro and uncle kusno kusro's different one more uh, point we can observe and what is that more point and that is we, we can observe in the positive that is gentle heart means outer appearance or casual uh, talking if you are observing that person you may feel that person is the rude very rude that person is speaking but when you will have in communication or experience with the same person and when you will spend more time with the same person you will observe that same personality is the gentle personality as like here it is given and that person was a homesick and the farmer went away and i ran over to my cousin morad's house he was sitting under a peach tree trying to repair the hurt wings of young robin which could not fly he was talking to the bird now this is again love for the animal suppose you will observe any animal uh, that animal or the bird uh, is injured then what will happen sometime you may neglect and uh, you may go 
from the place. But here it is uh, reference it is given about the young Robin, that Robin bird. He was sitting under a peach tree trying to repair the hurt wings of young Robin which could not fly. He was talking to the bird. So initially you can observe that two boys because of only longing or the strong desire they were riding that horse. But at the same time it was not the thing we can observe uh, in the same way. Some students in their life, how they are behaving with a, a friend, sometimes with teachers, or now we can observe in the <laughs> online teaching also, that they are not honest means they may not observe the video uh, carefully they may show just uh, that we are uh, doing that and they are cheating their parents as well they are cheating themselves as well so when you are alone and responsibility it is given to you that you have to develop by your own then suppose you are pretending to do that then that pretendence will not give you the satisfaction. You may cheat one time to others, you may cheat again second time, third time, but one day it will come that uh, you will realize your mistake also and you will go away from the mainstream. So this thing uh, nobody here we are expecting as a teacher from you that you would be the citizen means the responsible citizen of the India and suppose you are mm, not concerned about your studies, you are not uh, sincere about your studies, then what is the thing we can expect from you? So uh, try to understand your role as a student, uh, try to be uh, punctual, think about the, each and every aspect of the story, uh, think about the characters and the moral uh, lesson from that character, moral lesson from the story, what we can uh, get from that and do it with interest. That is very important. Nowadays uh, in premier lecture also I am observing the same thing that very few students uh, they are watching it on time and remaining they are just showing uh, and others uh, means thumb they can show okay they, uh, when it is a live premiere that time they are just showing the thing that we are there but suddenly again we can observe that the watching uh, children means the number of children those are watching it is less then what is this that you wish to, to do that thing but you are not doing with 100% effort and this is the thing that uh, it may impact further uh, means your discipline how to maintain your own discipline self discipline because when you are in front of the teacher we can control but when you are at home and you have to control yourself you have to control your own other all things and you have to be uh, on time and uh, that response it is very important so i feel that uh, whenever you will have such type of sessions um, either it is uh, live or premiere uh, or any video teachers will send but your response i am expecting that there should be positive response to all the uh, teachers Okay, little bit, uh, it was important, so I have uh, discussed that point. Then here we can observe the positive trait uh, in children, that when they are observing that the bird or animal is injured, and when they are engaged in that work to save that animal, save that bird. So this is the very important life skill we can observe. And that life skill, and now current, education system it is also uh, means recently 
everybody can understand the new policy of education it is announced and in that more focus it is given on the life skills right what you learn it should reflect in your behavior so if you have, there is no change in the behavior pattern then we cannot say that that is the learning so here what is it he said the farmer john byro i said he visited our house he wants his house you have had it a month i want you to promise not to take it back until i learned right so here i want you to promise not to take it back until i learn to write and that was the longing to write desire to write so here we can observe such type of expressions and small children we we can observe that uh, this type of expressions are natural expressions it will take a year to learn to write my cousin murad said so it is not one day task that uh, you will learn that writing and it will take so many days to have a hold on that or control and mastery over such type of writing we could keep the keep a horse a year i said the, the cousin murad uh, lift to his feet what he roared because he was the natural descendant of uh, uncle kusro so he used to speak in such a way so word is used here roared are you inviting a member of the gargul family to still the horse must go back to its true owner and now this statement it is stating their firmness or hallmarks two hallmarks that is honesty and the trust so this now through this discussion we can observe that two hallmarks that they don't want to break that hallmark as a trust of that gargol and family of that tribe they don't want to means the armenian tribe and from that specially the gargol family they don't want, don't want to break that uh, trust and they are also honest with their own perspective so this important aspect uh, we can observe through this and this line you can uh, mark underline that when i say in 6 month at the, the latest he said he threw the bird into the air the bird tried hard almost uh, fell twice but at last flew away high and straight so here the finally the result is also clear declared that the robin bird hmm, it may happen that in the first attempt that bird because of the hurt because of the injury that bird may not fly properly but that bird also can try and the same thing here uh, the high and straight means after some problems how the birds or everyone they are also adapting this that adaptation it is important we have to cope up with uh, the problems and if we will cope up with the problems nothing is going to happen then one more again uh, important thing we can observe here that is uh, he threw the bird into the air the bird uh, tried hard almost fell twice but at last few now uh, flew away high and straight uh, early every morning for two weeks my cousin mora then i took the horse out of the barn and of the deserted vineyard where we were hiding it so your place is mentioned at where uh, they used to hide the horse so underline that because when um, objective questions would be said then you should also know and when you will highlight it when you will make the list of the places and correlate with the means conceptually you should be clear and and means here the data which you are noting it should be precise so you can 
revise that uh, lesson as early as possible. We were hiding it and uh, rode it. And every morning the house here, every morning uh, the horse. When it was my turn to ride alone, uh, lift over uh, grape vines and small trees and threw me and run away. Nevertheless, I hope in time to learn to ride the way my cousin Morad rode. On morning, on the way to Fetwij in uh, deserted vineyard, we ran into the uh, farmer John Bayru, uh, who was on his way to town. And now again, uh, the reference of the John Bayru here it is given. And what is that important now? From this important new phase will start. And what is that new phase now we will discuss. Let me do the talking. My cousin Murad said, I have a way with farmers. And I have a way with farmers means I can understand, I can have a talk with them. And that is very essential. So, good morning, John Bayro. My cousin Murad said to the farmer, the farmer studied the horse eagerly. And now, the farmer that studied the horse means he observed the horse very carefully, that careful observation we can observe. Good morning, son of my friends, he said. And now, that is the warm uh, greeting and son of my friends. Here, friends, if again that thing, it is very important that if uh, somebody would say, uh, see you like this, then how can you observe? Son of my friends, he said. What is the name of the, what is the name of your horse? My heart, my cousin Murad said in Armenia. So here, my heart. How can we uh, mention such type of name? But here, that was the intensity and the new aspect of their personality we can mention here. It is not only the animal, that horse, it is their heart, like that here, somebody will say like this, means we can say such type of thing to our intimate personality, but here, very close, intimate, to, to whom you love too much, we can use that type of uh, expressions or the name we can give. But here the name it is given to the horse. So through this we can understand the love for the animal and that nature it is here important. It was not the pretendence. That was the honesty. They were honestly sharing that things and that honesty uh, here we can observe that it was from their heart. It was not like that. Uh, they were uh, cheating that farmer. So this is my heart. My cousin Murad said in Armenian, a lovely name, John Byro said, for a lovely horse. And now John Byro started praising that this is different name. And how is the name? A lovely name, John Byro said, for a lovely horse. And horse is also very beautiful, magnificent, and that beautiful horse has beautiful name. So this here we can, I could swear, it is the horse that was stolen from me many weeks ago. May I look into his mouth? And here, I could swear it is the horse that was stolen from me many weeks ago. May I look into his mouth? And here, uh, the farmers, those who are taking care of the animal, they can observe uh, the mouth, everything inside, the, especially the teeth, uh, they are observing. Each and everything, that close observation of the animals, we can observe through this, that those who are taking care of the animals, very honestly, uh, they would understand each and everything of that animal, how that animal will react, everything through their experience they can observe. So here, for that sake, may I 
look into his mouth. It is, of course, Murad said, the farmer looked into the mouth of the horse and tooth for tooth. He said, he said, I would say, I would swear, it is my horse. And he was firm on that. The seam, the horse, it is seam because we can observe each and everything if it is as it is. Then uh, he could say that it is my horse. But what happened next? There, there is again the thing. Uh, I would swear it is my horse. If I didn't know your parents, I would say directly that it is my horse. But why I am not saying? Because I know your parents. And I know your family's trust. I know the reputation of your family. Even though you are poor, but centuries we are the fame of your uh, Gargolan family that was the trust. And you are from that family. So, your, the fame of your family for honesty is well known to me. And you will not cheat like that here, uh, it is indirectly the farmer it is stating. And the horse uh, is the twin of my horse. It may happen that it may be the twin, means twin of the horse. So each and everything it is looking like the same. A suspicious man would believe his eyes instead of his heart. Good day, my young friends. So, there is there is no any kind of suspicious mind now here it is working. Because one mind is stating that yes, it is my horse. But as there is an experience about that family that no one would do such type of task. They were honest so many uh, centuries of, the reputation of that family it was like that so he thought in another way it may be the twin of the horse good day john byro my cousin Murad said early the following morning we took the horse to john byro's vineyard and put it uh, in the barn the dogs followed us around without making a sound and dogs also followed him so here uh, bird robin the horse dogs so everything here we can observe that right? love for the animal love for the birds and how to uh, take care of them and handle that uh, it is here clearly picturized and to understand human being also means how to keep the relations how to keep trust honesty so all things here uh, we are observing through this uh, story. Then again, here we can observe. Uh, good day, John Byro. My cousin Mora said. Early the following morning, you know, we took the horse to John Byro's vineyard and put it in the barn. The dog followed us around without making a sound. The dogs. I whispered to my cousin Morat. I thought they would bark. I thought they would bark. But here, how? Without making a sound, they were there. They would <clears throat> add somebody else. Uh, he said, I have a way with dogs. So here, uh, earlier statement we can observe, he said that I have a way with horse. Then I have a way with the farmer. Then now again he is making the statement that is, I have a way with dogs. Means uh, I can have that approach, uh, how to handle, how to tackle, how to negotiate. The things, such type of uh, things. Means that boy is also only 13 years old, Mr. Moran. But he was tackling such type of situations very efficiently and unders with understanding with confidence and that confidence uh, we can observe in mature personalities but here it is observed in the uh, teenage age group so here uh, my 
कजिन मोराथ पुट हिज आर्म्स अराउंड द हॉर्स नाउ सपोज दिस इज द डिपार्चर सीन लाइक अ ह्यूमन बीइंग नाउ दैट हॉर्स विल बी डिपार्टेड फ्रॉम द मोराथ सो हियर व्हाट इज द थिंग हियर वी कैन ऑब्जर्व वी वी आर आल्सो डूइंग व्हेन योर family member if uh, they are going to depart from you while departure scene you, you may hug that uh, person the same thing here also uh, we can observe and that is my cousin murad put his arm around the horse uh, press his nose into house nose and patted it and then um, we went away means uh, this was the different experience here uh, narrator and the author is trying to state that it was not only the desire to uh, ride that horse but there was love also means that bond was also created with the uh, same horse and this is very important thing that only for the selfish thing means you wish to ride and you are not taking care of the horse so this would be contrast thing but here we are observing that there was intensity to ride the horse there was a longing strong desire to ride the horse but at the same time here it is also mentioned that there was the same bond that love it was also there in his heart and so the name of the horse it is my heart it was uh, given by the boys so this new experience we are observing through this so positive traits of the uh, personality we can mention in the answer then that afternoon john byro uh, came to our house in his surrey and showed my mother the horse that had been stolen and returned so here uh, it is mentioned that the sari or that such type of card mm, we can observe here the john byros uh, again means there was no blame also there was no blame from his side so this is very important thing that afternoon uh, john byro came to her house in his sari and showed my mother the horse that had stolen and returned means it was taken uh, for some days and now it is again returned i don't know what to think he said i don't know what to think he said the horse is uh, stronger than ever better temper too i thank god the horse is stronger than ever and it was stolen but it the the same horse it was taken care in such a way that it is stronger than ever so this is the very important thing here we can observe that even though it was not there with the farmer but the boys they have taken more care of the horse better temper to i thank god my uncle khusro uh, who was in the parlor became irritated and shouted quite man quite your horse has been returned pay no attention to it and again the ending it is with the comic ending we can observe uh, right he was again the same character when any character repeats the same thing then it becomes the comic thing for others and the same uh, ending so here author is trying to mention through this story means here adventure is also there then love for animal we can observe then bonding it is also important then new features of the same character also uh, how the mother the narrator means aram's mother here as he was stating about uh, uncle kusru that how his personality is gentle heart then the bonding of the uh, children also we can observe they how they were thinking about the uh, family specially so now the question it is there that right? now uh, the student like you you are getting all the facilities your parents they are providing all the things 
so uh, i feel that you should also think that how, what is the reputation of my uh, family are they uh, taking care of you so obviously your parents they are taking care of you they have given you very good environment they have taken the decision to give you very uh, means important thing that they have given you opportunity to learn in different different fields then they have created very nice environment for you so now it is also your responsibility that you should also keep that trust means their trust on you whatever now it is there it should not be broken got it and you should also have the same thing that honesty you should also be honest with yourself and uh, you should not pretend that you are doing something some now what you will do you will take the mobile or the pc or something and you will show that i am doing that i am doing it parents may come they may observe and they will also feel satisfied that yes my child is doing from morning to evening my child is engaged with that studies and now after some days uh, the result will come very uh, good marks he will obtain secure and then they may imagine for your future but suppose you are cheating them what will happen in future so you can observe that so honesty and trust that both the hallmarks uh, how the boys maintain that you can also maintain when uh, you are doing the task daily task that time you also maintain that and some students they are maintaining that it is uh, whatever i am saying it is not for them only those those who are not maintaining such type of things so for them uh, from today everyone you think in this manner and fear only the stories or whatever the things uh, it is given for you in the syllabus it is not only for the exam sake because life skills are here important that after learning this experience there should be change in the behavior we should also introspect we should also think write in your own language about this that what i learned from the story and how can i implement that in my own life so when you will write in your diary when you are write in the notes when you will summarize that when you will write the briefings or the important highlights by your own okay sometimes there may be mistakes but slowly slowly it will be also rectified by your own or with the help of teachers and you will enhance the abilities whatever the abilities are said or the learning outcomes is expected by the cbsc it will also be fulfilled so it is my uh, suggestion to everyone that uh, be honest with you and whatever you learn from the story uh, implement it observe yourself observe your thoughts observe your daily routine your schedule and when the answer will come your inner voice when your inner voice will say yes whatever i am doing that is correct your inner conscience when inner conscience will give you the answer that whatever you are doing that is correct and that voice that answer that you accept because your inner voice will never say wrong to you so accept that inner conscience and that is the major conscience that nobody else can understand but you can understand by your own so today we will uh, stop here think i hope that uh, you will change yourself and those who are doing regular for them uh, continue as you are regular punctual and you are doing very good and i hope that such type of uh, good citizens we are expecting in this uh, phase in the in this new era new scenario new things will happen and you will be the uh, one of them means in future we 
means others will read your philosophy others will talk about you and others will feel happy when they will uh, read about you so something extraordinary means being ordinary or just uh, do the task whatever it is and don't go ahead if this type of uh, nature then it will be like the there are so many creatures uh, in this world they are not being noticed by the world so you should not feel that you are like that so you think that you are the unique and something you wish to uh, do in your life so i hope that you will observe your uniqueness and that uniqueness will give you a uh, very important thing that is confidence and that confidence will lead our nation ahead thank you